Hey everybody, the Gaming Guru 51 here, and welcome back to Banjo To Be Blind. In the last episode, we collected two Jiggies here in Cloud Kukuland, the most we've ever made in progress thus far in any world ever. I mean, we've collected two Jiggies in other worlds too, but like, in the first time getting in here, that's pretty impressive. In this episode, though, we're going to continue exploring this area. Hopefully, we can get, continue on with the progress like we have been, and hopefully, things go good for us. Oh. Well, there's Mumbo for you. That's pretty sweet. Um, oh, or I could just fall. Is that is that gonna? That is death right here. Yup, that's a mistake that I made just now. Oh my goodness! And the fact that you have to wait to fall to your death. So in this world, I'm not gonna take too much damage from enemies. I'm just gonna fall every time. And you know what? I that's okay. Well, you know, we do have a warp. I don't know what the heck I'm thinking here. Let's take the warp. What is that safe right there on that icon? Oh, it's right there. <laughs> okay. Well, um, hopefully we can solve the mystery of the two mumbos. Because, good lord, why the heck are there, are there like two different transformations? But why would he be in two different places at once? I have no idea. So what's going on with this guy? Is there anything behind him? No? Do we want to go inside? This is a fake, isn't it? Oh my god, it's real. The Black Jinjo family is complete. They like to have you... They like to... Dude. Mumbo, you sleeping, man. What's going on with you? Don't be sleeping, Mumbo. Hello, Banjo. Mumbo had big surprise for you. Oh, I like surprises. Is it like a transformation? Because that's kind of cool. Oh my god, Minji Jongo, Crafty Shaman, what? Hard, 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 foolish bear, you fell straight into my trap. I'm not that pathetic shaman you think I am. I'm Minji Jongo, and your worthless quest ends here. Are you kidding me? As you see, there's no escape and resistance is futile. What? Dude, you got me, game. Oh, okay. At least I can hit you, that's good. My elaborate disguise is ruined, revealing my evil cyboticness. Holy cow! Look at this guy! What do I just have to avoid him and then, like, when he has an opening, I can hit him? Sure enough, that is the plan. Good gracious, man. Like, the first hit, it's gonna be the same for all the others. I figured, you know, after the first few hits, he'll change it up. Okay, then hit him. There we go. Five more to go. This is crazy! No wonder why there's two mumbos. Because one of them's a fake man. Jeez, also look at him. He's turning crazy. Okay, now he's changing up the plan here. Oh, almost got me. Oh. Is there going to be an opening I can hit him with? There's the opening. Okay. So far, this is actually pretty easy. Oh, okay, don't be in the middle. Dude! I'm guessing the further away you are, the easier it is to avoid damage. Because it seems to be homing. Like, right here. See, you can't even... Oh, he got, he got me there. Like, at least they give you help. And the camera changes are really screwing with me right now. Like, look at this crap. Okay, see? You can't just do that. Ugh. Got him. There we go. I got the health, which is nice. Oh, man. He's faster. Look at this. This is so crazy. Ugh. I gotta beat this, though. Because if I don't, I'm gonna cry about it. Uh, get him! There we go. One more. Oh my goodness, look at him. He's completely robotic. Minji Jongo. What a name, man. He's like the Minjo of this world, basically. Okay, you cannot be that. Ooh, got him! I calculate my chances of stopping you are now minimal. Dude. Oh my god. He's like... <laughs> okay. Jiggy? In the first five minutes of- Man! At this rate, we'll beat this world in no time. But I'm not gonna say- I'm not gonna get my hopes up. There's gonna be some things that I'm sure there's gonna be an episode of doing nothing like everything else in every world we've done. Like, especially in, like, in Grunty Industries. I probably spent, like, two videos doing nothing, you know? But, good god. I'm gonna assume that means by process of elimination that the other Mumbo's hut is the real one? Or something? Good lord, man. Okay, so... That's cool. Uh... 
Oh, I see another entry down there, and I also see some nodes. Let's go ahead and head over there and see what we can find. Oh, sure enough, Mumbo Pad. There you go. I still have not seen any Globos. Like, geez, where are they? Is that where we started? I think that's where we started. Jeez, there's so much. I don't even know if I want to go in here. But I guess I'm going to. And of course, that's a fake. That's nice. Oh boy, what is that? Okay. Oh my god. Oh my god, my timing was absolutely crap. Mumbo, sir, are you okay? Can we talk to you to make sure that you're not going to murder me like the other guy? Are you okay, sir? Welcome back. Oh. Mumbo wants to help a need magic creature. Baron got no. Okay, so this is like 100% genuine whole Pepperidge Farms milk Mumbo. Okay. Um, that's nice. So, that's cool. What's over here then? Let's go and just do some more exploring because I feel like there's a lot we have not explored yet. I feel like there's a lot we can do. This is gonna take me somewhere. I guess we might as well take it and find out where it's gonna go. So let's just go down. Sir, take me away to a magical land. Sir? Okay, I was gonna say, are you gonna take me away or not? <laughs> Jeez, man. Look at Banjo. He looks so cute just flying around, you know? Oh, I see. We need Kazooie alone. Hmm. Which also begs the question, where are we going to find a split pad? I'm guessing there's one. Who knows, honestly. Well, this is going to take me to a completely different path. Look at th look at this. It's so ridiculous. Like, look at him. He's not even, like, flying any... Oh. Okay. Well, what we can do is we can split. And we can take the pad. And see where it does. Luckily for us, these guys do not give us health. I would like some health, because if I die, I'm going to cry, honestly. What is going on over here? What do you have to say? Greetings, fleshy ones. Wow, a talking safe. Correct. I'm a super stash deluxe. Four digit, infinite combination, reinforced strong box. But four digits only gives you 10,000 combinations. Hey, no one likes a wise guy. It's enough up here. Let's have a look inside then. Oh, that might be a problem. I seem to have forgotten my own combination. Perhaps they should have spent a little more on your intelligence, Chip. I know. Sorry, fleshy ones. But if you could find the combination, I'll gladly open up. You know, honestly, I have no... I was just going to say, there is absolutely no reason why I'm walking around with one health. That's just asking for trouble. But luckily for us, again, warp pad. No penalties here. We get to go straight back here, which is actually where I want to go. Because we could take good old Kazooie by herself to that area with a single Kazooie switch. And I think that's a pretty good thing to do now since it's on it's on it's fresh in my mo in my bones. Fresh in the mind, you know. What's the fastest method to get there? We could just, you know, travel like this. So we'll just do this. Like, look how fast that is. That's so convenient. And then I want to go down. And then. I can hit this, I'm guessing. Yeah, you can go inside. Oh, I was gonna say, is it gonna turn off or like something? I need Banjo to enter it? I was gonna say. What is inside the trash can? Oh, a visitor! Guffo doesn't get many visitors in this trash can. I'm not surprised, it stinks! I prefer to think of it as an acquired aroma. Perhaps you can help me. I'm facing eviction from my trash can by the health and hygiene department unless I clean the place up. Shall I tell you about the problem? Sure. It's these filthy germs that live in here. I've been told to get rid of 50 points. Of course, killing red germ. Yeah, we've seen this before. Will you give it a try? Sure. You've got 60 seconds to kill 50 points worth of germs. Ready? Okay, this is the minigame. Do I just touch him? Oh, I just have to whack him. That's what I gotta do. Uh, as long as I don't suck, this should be pretty easy. Sir! Hmm. This might actually be challenging, depending on the situation, of course. Uh, like, so far, I'm actually doing pretty bad. Is there, like, shoes I can use to, like, 
make myself faster for this situation because I feel like unless you just outright just spin against everything and hope to goodness you survive. I mean, so I'm actually might be able to hit it if I don't play badly, basically. Uh, so far, I'm actually doing pretty good. There's 50 points right there. Yeah, we already done it. So there you go. I'm not sure how good I actually did here. But you can't touch them. You have to hit them. So yeah, I see. This is like the best way to just kind of get into like a center point. There you go. Great. You kill 72 points worth. I get to keep my lovely trash can. And you get to keep this. Sweet. What the heck is in there? Well, first off, let's cut the jiggy. Fancy trying for a new germ best score? No, I don't. Thanks. See you later to all your friends there. Welcome to visit. Hey, what the heck's in here? I'm guessing that's how you get the Jinjo. I also see a clockwork Kazooie thing. Jeez, man. I was gonna say, could I glitch that? Probably not. Yeah, I don't think so. Hmm. Because, you know, I'm so good at breaking this video game. Right? What's down there? Just eggs? Sure enough. Can I, like, fire a clockwork egg up there? I probably shouldn't be able to do this, honestly. I really probably shouldn't. But I'm gonna try. Let's stand on this. Oh, yeah, I could definitely shoot an egg up there. Honestly. Oh, it's possible, right? Uh, no. Oh, ho, 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 ho. and, oh, hold on, explode, explode. I have an idea. This is so, this is so beautiful. So let's shoot the egg. Okay. Please? Uh. Oh my god, how did I do this a second ago just now? How did I get up there? Oh my goodness. Oh! I have one more try. Oh my god. Please, I, I have a plan and it could work so good. Oh! Okay, fine. I feel like I was onto something there. But that's fine. We're out of here. I don't even have any more Kazooie clockwork eggs. I'm going to have to get some more. Dang! That would have been so nice if that worked out as well as it did. I'm just going to go ahead and fall and get back to being Banjo. Ooh. Which means, you know what? I'm going to need... Oh, you know what? I would still need Kazooie anyway, wouldn't I? Oh, you know what? I could just... Couldn't I have done that from the outside? Oh, dude. I need Kazooie eggs. I'm going to need one, right? Just one to do the task. I see him. <gasps> I see him. Oh, dude. What the freak? All right, I'm going to need some eggs. Hold on. Let me go ahead and uh, take this and get back over there. Because I think... I think... Dude. Stop. Just stop, please. These guys don't even give me any health. They're just there to annoy the crap out of me. So let's meet, let's meet you guys over there one last time. Sir! Also, hold on. I just heard a Globo as well. So there's that. There's feathers. I don't really need that. Is this the right side? It is, because that's where the trash is. Okay. So I'm going to assume that it's behind here, right? Yeah, I have no idea why I was even thinking doing all that crap, but I could just do this. <laughs> okay, let's do this. Like a smart person here. Do I have to have to blow up on this? You do. So the four is at the end. Okay. So there you go. Well... I guess there's nothing else I can do here. Well, goodbye! <laughs> I'm sorry, but that's literally the best way to like get around, to get back to a point, you know? I did hear a Globo. I really did. Where was it? What the? Is that where I just was, or is that a completely different spot? Well, what I'm going to do, I'm going to get those shoes, and we're going to go over there and see where it's over there. Because that would be a good idea to do. Luckily, in this position, this uh, these shoes, you can actually jump and they don't run out. So we can go just climb up here. Oh, the timer's running out. Not enough. Oh, there's some notes, though. What's up here, then? 
Oh, another egg. Oh my goodness, I need to be Kazooie alone again? Ugh. Okay, well that's fine. Whatever. What's over here? Is this how to get back to the trash? Oh. I don't want to do any of this. <laughs> I'm going to meet you guys by uh, when Kazooie's by herself again. Okay, so here we are with the shoes once again. We're going to climb back up here as Kazooie. We're going to take the path up here. I really need to get some eggs, so I'm going to have to do all that at some point. So I can... Because I see a Kazooie path right there as well. I see another egg thing, so we got to go and hatch them. And see what this one brings. Uh, sir. Sir. Thank you. Let's do it. I also see a place over there I can uh, fly to as Kazooie as well. It's so cute! What does this even do? Like, I can't even activate it! What is over there? Yeah, let's just let's just glide over here and see what it does. I see a little hole. Uh, do I? What? What do I put? A, do I throw an egg in there? I don't have any clockwork eggs to do anything. So if I did have to, oh Kazooie, you look ridiculous. Jeez, I, I feel like at the uh, beginning of the next episode, I really need to grind for some uh, clockwork eggs. That's going to be important, because I feel like I'm going to need a bunch of eggs. And I'm surprised that did not kill me. <laughs> well, while I am Kazooie, I can get some eggs over here, so there you go. Jeez, man. Now, oh, I see. I see, I see, I see. Well, there's one of them. We'll take this long path over here, and I'm guessing that's how we're going to get to our spot. Yeah, here we go. So, what is that, a, a nine or a six? I did not even pay attention. That is definitely a nine. Hmm. Cool, that's two out of four. And Kazooie cannot climb. So, what would be the next point of action to do here? There's still quite a bit I have not done in here yet, to be honest. And... I kind of want to do some more exploring. Like, there's stuff over there I can go do. There's something up here. I hear a Globo as well. I hear him hopping. Sir, there's a there's an area over there too. Jeez. What's down there? There's the Globo. There he is. But before we grab him, I'll go ahead and grab him in a second. What does this have to say? Oh, sir. Have you looked in this pool yet? Yes, there's a Globo in it. I understand. We'll take it. <laughs> okay. All right, Banjo. Ooh! Oh. Once again, I can Kazooie egg over there and grab that. Which, speaking of eggs, I really do need eggs. So I feel like I'm inclined to collect some eggs now. Luckily for Banjo, he can uh, climb ledges where Kazooie cannot do yet at all. I don't even think. Alright, cool. We got three Kazooie eggs. Or three clockwork eggs. So that's nice. Now we're off to get the Globo, which is our next task. Because we can then choose to take it to Wumba or Wum or Wumbo or Mumbo. Let's just do this. There he is. Look at him. Look at him being cute. Come here, Globo. Can't hide from me, good sir. I appreciate you. Now, I could try to get the, uh, Oh, you know what? We don't even have to try. We don't even have to shoot an egg in there, do we? What I can do... He's way up there. So I can probably grab that as Kazooie alone with the shoes. I feel like that might give me enough height. We can try. So let's do it. Sir. So how high do I have to be to grab this? Like here, maybe? Oh, yeah. Perfect. Look at this. There you go. We're really collecting these gingos right now, which is awesome. Now, hmm, do I want to do anything else? Have I even been all the way up there yet? Don't think I have. Uh, I can either go up here or I can go down to wherever I'm thinking of. I have no idea. We can go up here because I have not been up here yet. I feel like I should. So there's a path up here, and I might as well take it. I could also take the flying pad and go around as well to the top. See if there's anything up there. Who knows? 
But let's see what's over here. Okay. There's something over here. What's over here? Is that what I think it is? Is this a mumbo? Oh my goodness, it's definitely a mumbo pad. Well, that's also noted because I'm sure it's actually pretty easy to do right now, so I can go ahead and do that. But I think I'm actually going to do that next time because we're doing pretty good. Um, let's go and check our tolls to see what we're uh, dealing with here for collectibles because I think we're doing pretty good. Four Jiggies, one um, one of those three Jinjos. We're really making progress in here. I'm, I'm pretty surprised. Jeez, awesome. Well, there you go. I'm going to end it off here next time on Banjo Tui. Some more Cloud Cuckoo Land. And there's actually a lot I'm going to try to do. There's a lot I can do right now. I can fly with the, the, the wings or whatever, the flight pads. There's also that. I've already done that. There's also that area over there I haven't checked out. There's a lot of things we can do. So, we're going to do all that. But that being said, everybody, thank you guys so very much for watching. And I'll see you guys next time for some more Banjo Tui Blind. I will see you guys then.